Hello everyone, it's me, it's Jonah from A Satellite Place. Today I'm going to be doing an updated Warrior Cat book collection. This is going to be a lot quicker because I'm not going to pull them out and then show you what the cover looks like. Because obviously, if you have Google, you can obviously Google the cover if you really, really want to know what it looks like. So I got the full Prophecies Begin collection in paperback with the old McLaughlin art, which I really love. There's another one that I need to get, but it has to be the hardback version because there's a I think there's like two hard pack versions of one of them. I'm pretty sure it's this one because there's an alternate cover of Rising Storm. I don't know if it's Rising Storm or Dangerous Path. It's one of these two, but it has an alternate cover in hardback. But yeah, this is a complete collection of the paperback. Then we have Red Cats, The New Prophecy. New Prophecy good that's the this is, this is the first thing i read i didn't read the original series i read the new prophecy the thing is with this is that out of every single one of them the the, the i don't know what it, what it was but where's new prophecy seemed to have the worst like formatting because the the icons did not line up with the other ones and so yeah this is it's, it's a cool thing, but it just kind of like, yeah, it's kind of what bugs me about this, but really good. Glothen art. Then I have a paperback version of, I have every book but the first book in paperback of Omen of the Stars. I haven't read this. I'm still stuck on the third book, which I do not own a physical copy for. So, yeah. But yeah, the Omen of the Stars. I got these back in December. Or, no, wait, November. So I got Fading Echoes, Night Whispers, Sign of the Moon, The Forgotten Warrior, and The Last Hope. The reason why I was really excited about this is that it had, like, the like the sampling things from the little warrior cat, like, tabletop game. It had, like, because it says... Exclusive adventure board game inside. Uh, not board game. Exclusive adventure game inside. So I was really happy to get these. Concerning the fact that I only got them for 99 cents. And normally they would have been charged around $1.99. For whatever reason. But ever since Goodwill changed the prices of books. You can find the main series of Warrior Cat books. Because they're smaller. For about 99 cents. However if you go to like the super editions or the hardbacks they're gonna be a lot more they'll be like five dollars per hardback or super edition then i got warriors uh gray stripes adventure which gray stripe is one of my favorite characters besides blue uh let's call him blue jay uh jay jay feather there we go that's his name sorry i've been stuck because i can't get a copy of the third book of this series. So yeah. Uh, then I have the paper. Uh, I find really good paper. I, I, I don't know why, but I find the paperbacks and hardbacks of Warrior Cats really easily for some reason. Um, hardback of The Darkest Hour. Hardback of Moonrise. Yes, this came. It's always funny when they have like this like little sticker stuff when they're discarded from the libraries that they come from. So I've got like books from like Florida, books from Massachusetts, books from Wyoming, stuff like that. So I kind of find that really interesting. So this is Moonrise, Twilight. Then I have every book but the third book. And then I have the first book of Omen of Stars, The Fourth Apprentice, and Hardback. Which technically I do have all of the books of Omen of Stars, but they're not in the I'm gonna kind of a bit anal about trying to get them in paperback or hardback if I can so that they're all matching. Then I have my newer covered, newer covers. So I've got the first three books of Dawn of the Clans at different times. I got the Sun Trail, Thunder Rising, and the First Battle. I have the first three books of The Prophecy Begins, Into the Wild, Fire, Fire and Ice, and Force of Secrets. And then I have the new Prophecy, Moonrise and Sunset. There was one that I put back because I already had the, the McLaughlin art. I didn't really need another one. But if I find them for 99 cents, I might pick them up again. 
I might pick it up because I think it's it was one of the new prophecy ones. So uh, then here I have my super editions. Funnily enough, this is an original pressing of original pressing of Firestar's Quest. This is a later pressing of Bruce Blue Star's Prophecy, and this is a pretty sure a. Let me pull that out. This is pretty, I'm pretty sure. I don't know when they started adding the manga to the books. Because this is 2010. So, I don't know if it's a... I don't know. That's that's the thing. I really don't know if this is like first or second pressing. But this has like 2009 copyright date. This has a 2010 one. And then I have Tiger Heart Shadow, which I got from Half Price Books. And then my... Secrets of the Clans Warrior's Field Guide. I don't have anything else really to show because I I don't have I can't find anything really around here. Because the Warrior Cat books I do find, I already have them. And I have to find like my missing ones. Um there was a there was an opportunity to get uh for me to get a better version of the site for five bucks, and I'm like, I already have the book already fixed the spine i don't really need it <laughs> so yeah if so yeah that's my thing i got most of my books from half price books a store called second sale goodwill and then some flea shop flea markets and of course flea bay or ebay i mean everyone calls it flea bay because it's just basically a flea market where everyone I accept the price on everything, but Warrior Cat books, man, like, what? And I remember going into, like, the, the library when I was, like, 10, no, 11, and, like, looking at the Warrior Cat books, I'm like, oh my goodness, I love this. And I wasn't really introduced to Warrior Cats until I was, like, in fifth grade, which I was like, oh my gosh, what is this? So, yeah, my... My friends did this to me. Now I'm living my childhood dream of trying to collect all these Warrior Cat books. And I really want to read all of them one day. But yeah. I, uh, if, if, if I can't get that third book by in so long, I'm just going to have to read. I'm going to have to backtrack and read Blue Star's Prophecy because I already finished these two super editions. And I need to wait to finish this. I need to wait to start this one until I know what the hell is going on. It's 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 a great thing. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.